Have you ever had video that wasn't level or just needed to be turned or flipped to make it look right? We've all been there. It happens to the best of us, even your PD professor. So it's great to know that you can fix those issues with a few simple tools in PowerDirector 365. There are several ways to rotate videos using PowerDirector, but I'm gonna show you four of the tools that I like to use. If you wanna see some other ways to rotate or spin objects, search for PowerDirector University Rotate or PowerDirector University Spin on YouTube. The first tool you can use to rotate is the preview window. You can left click on a clip on the timeline and then you'll see these nodes appear around your preview window. You can place your cursor over a node until you see these curved arrows or curved line with two arrows on each end. Hold down your left mouse and then you can drag it as far as you want to rotate it. The second tool you can use to rotate is the position and size tool. You want to left click on a clip. You want to go to edit. You want to make sure you're under the video tab and you also want to make sure you're under tools. And here you will see the position, size and flip section. Once again, you can place your cursor over one of these nodes and you can rotate it here. You can also use this dial Place your cursor over the dial, hold down your left mouse button, and you can rotate it by different increments and different degrees right here. Or you can type in the degree of rotation that you want. You can also flip your video horizontally or vertically using this tool. Click on vertical. You see it'll flip it right side up or you can flip on horizontal to flip it that way. When you're done, you can close out the tool. Now, if you found the first two rotation tools useful, like this video, subscribe to Power Director University and click the notification bell so you don't miss any of my tutorials and live streams. The third tool you can use to rotate objects is the pan and zoom tool. You want to left click on a video clip. You want to go to edit. Make sure that you're under video. Make sure you're under tools. And then you want to go down to pan zoom and left click that. So this interface opens up. You can left click on your clip in here. Now you can place your cursor over a node until you see the line with two arrows. Hold down your left mouse button and you can drag that. Or you can go to the rotate and you can type in the parameter that you want and hit enter. As you can see in the preview window, there are black bars. If you don't want those black bars, you can remove them. If you place your cursor over a node, hold down your left mouse when you see a line, a straight line with two arrows, hold down your left mouse and you can drag this in. And as you can see in the preview window, the black bars are getting smaller. Now, I also want to move his head down a little bit because in a preview window, I can see that his head is chopped off. So you can use your position to do that. Keep in mind, anything outside of this blue box will not be seen in your video. When you're done, you can click on OK. And next is the fourth and final tool, which is the crop and rotate tool. So you want to left click on your video clip. And here over the timeline, you can see there are some icons and one of them is for crop and rotate. It says crop the selected video. Left click on that. And you see that the tool works exactly the same as the pan and zoom tool. And I already showed you how to use that. So I'm not gonna show you how to use it again. But if you wanna make your video spin on a dime, check out this tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe for more Power Director love. See you next time.